Hey guys, I'm meteorologist Christy Kleimenhage and we thought it'd be fun to show you what a day in the life of a meteorologist looks like. So, I'm walking into work right now. There's work. <laughs> and we're gonna have some fun today. All right, we're here at the TV pod, TV slash reporting. Say hi, ladies. Hi, anime. Hi, Jill, back there. So they're getting to work putting the show together. And it's time for my first radio hit of the day. It's on Blue Sky, the noon hour college show. So let's go take a look. Hi there, Garth. Well, as Stephanie just said, it is going to be a busy day tomorrow for parts of central Saskatchewan. As we so yeah, that's my first radio hit. There's a bunch of radio hits throughout the day, but that one uh, is for the noon call-in show. But a lot of my day is actually building graphics on my system. So here's a look at my system. I'm kind of doing this left-handedly while I hold the camera. But you can see lots of graphics I can choose from or build for the show. Uh, so yeah, that's a big part of my day. It's lunchtime and I'm lucky enough to live close enough that I can zip home and see Maggie. Hi. <laughs> so I'm about to do some weather records for the radio because although most of the hits that I do are live during the day, there are some that I do re record beforehand. I'm meteorologist Christy Kleimenhaga taking a look at our weather over the next 24 hours and tomorrow some messy weather throughout the province seeing steady snowfall working its way through central Saskatchewan. Right, so those hits are done and I'm back out to my desk to finish up some of my weather models and uh, get that forecast done for TV. So I've been looking at different synoptic charts to try to pattern out a where our weather patterns are going to be over the next few days. And also, I've been building my forecast. So this is what I've come up with based on weather models. I'll take a look at those. So here's some of the models that I look at. They look at different conditions in the atmosphere over the next week or so. So you're 10 minutes before the show, just about. Time checking in the control room. Hi guys! We go up to the uh, studio. Where we've got our lovely camera guys. Hi guys. Hooked up. Hi Jill. Sure. Hi. How's it going? Excellent. It's a good day. Good day. It's good Monday. day. <laughs> and thank you for joining us tonight. Saskatchewan is unveiling part But here's a live look outside at Regina where temperatures today haven't been all that bad. Temperatures in the minus single digits feeling a little cooler when you factor in that uh, wind chill as as that does start to creep up, especially later this week. That's really where we're going to feel uh, that wind chill really taking an effect again. Now today temperatures, as I said, not too bad in those minus single digits for the most part, about minus five uh, in Regina right now, minus five in Saskatoon as well. Temperatures well above the freezing mark still uh, in that southwestern corner, four degrees in Maple Creek. Now that's this is a look at with our wind chill factored in, feeling in the minus double digits. So still a little bit of a chill in the air of the area and Prince Albert that through the day tomorrow even in Regina you could see a little bit of messy weather but quite mild there we go we survived another show it's Monday so we got lots more to do this week I hope you enjoyed my day in the life um, and yeah we'll see you really soon or every day six o'clock